So good morning. Today I'm going to be walking through using the Collative uh, Project Manager slash Client Manager interface program. So this is uh, the default page. I'm going to log right in. So this is my desktop. I'm the admin for this site. Uh, uh, this has got a user management system, but let's just walk through the main areas of this real quick. So the first tab up here is my desktop, which is what you see. The second tab is my account, which allows me to make changes to my email. I can edit um, this section and make changes. It also tells me the projects I have in the works right now. The third section is my settings section, which gives me a drop down for system admin. I can come here and make uh, changes to my projects, which controls that processing controls that. It's English. I'm in the Pacific time zone, Los Angeles. Uh, set my my date format. Uh, my template type is standard. My email and all that stuff. Uh, second tab under settings is user management. Um, you actually have different roles. Um, the admin has got um, full rights to every section of the project management add, edit, delete, close. A user has got uh, limited rights, um, you know, can delete but can close. Wow. A client has got very, very limited rights. Um, so that's a role section. Um, and the final section on the settings here is your project administration set, uh, section. Um, I have a test project already made. I can close this project and by closing this project under the project admin I can also view closed projects so if I click this it tells me this project has been closed so those are the main three tabs and this finally is the logout so let's head back to the desktop so we can walk through basic function functions of this so as you can see I have nothing going this shows me my current um, calendar month if I had um, a project or a milestone, it would display that right there. So let's go ahead and um, walk you through adding. I guess let's talk about this real quick. These are my projects. If I, as the admin, if I had projects, I would have that listed there. If I had tasks, they would be listed here. And if I had messages, they'll be listed here. Um, this program also has the capability of inter chat. I can actually chat with other users online. So if I had multiple users on here, user administration, and uh, they were online, I I would be able to chat with them live. So let's go right ahead and create a project and see how this works. So right here, I click on project, add a new project. I can type in a project, or say you're using this for a client, uh, you know, client processing. So let's go ahead and type in. A client's name. Let's call him Jack Jack Daniels. So Jack Daniels is the name of our project slash client. Uh, description is not necessary, but let's just say Jack Daniels um, is my client. Um, the date, due, budget, I leave that um, blank. Budget would most likely be the amount um, this project or client is uh, budgeted for. And just like that, I add this project, and there you go. Jack Daniel is now my first project on the, this campaign. Now, if I click on Jack Daniel, I can add a milestone. That's where you add milestones. I can add a task list, I can add a message, I can upload a file or folder, I can determine which users I want associated with this project. So if I add more users, I could actually add them. Um, I don't have any more users, just me. And a time tracker. So if you had employees and you wanted to track how much time they're spending on a project, that goes there. Uh, milestones, say I wanted to add a milestone, 
um, say status here in um, this client is due in caught on date specified. I can specify what day is doing court. So let's say the 26th of this month. I can add that time, that milestone, and a milestone is added right there. Um, if I go to my desktop, oh, what did I do? I believe the milestone I added was for a really weird date. So let's go ahead and edit that. I can tell from the date. February 28th, yeah, looks about right. There we go. So that's that's more like it. There you go. So that's a milestone I just added right there. And it tells you status here. And if I click a drop down, it tells me this client is doing court on X date. Very, very simple. Um, under this project, I could also add a message. Uh, and this message would be viewed by all involved in this project. So really quickly, I'm just going to type in call client to verify, blah, blah. Um, I can attach um, an image or a file, wherever I want it. I could notify everyone involved. Um, if I wanted to add a file, that's what I'll do. Um, and send. That's the message I've attached to this. Just by hitting my desktop, as you can tell, it tells me the activities that just went on. Um, I created a new client. I added a message right there. If I click on the client, it even goes further by giving me an activity report. It tells me Jack was created this day. Status hearing was added. That same status hearing was edited and a message was placed and all done by the user, which is me. So this is a really, really good project management software, um, Collaptive. It's a free open source um, software um, that needs um, heavy customization in order to work based on your application. Um, and it's, you know, there's so many, so many things you could do. Under this project, I can add a file. Um, right there. Uh, I have a drop down for different types of sheets. I can select the file from my PC if I had one to share, um, which I don't. But uh, you know, the, the possibilities with this program are endless. Um, collaborative. Um, what else can we do? We can create a task. Um, a task can be associated with a milestone. Um, test, task, testing. I can add that. And naturally, on my home page, if I clicked on Jack Daniels, tells me everything that went on. So this not only keeps track keeps track of your project, but it also tells you. Um, you know, notifies you because I would have actually gotten an email telling me that there was a new message added to this, a new file was uploaded, everything. So this is a really good project management software or client management software, however way the application is used. Um, thank you for watching and uh, have a good day.